Hey guys, welcome to Broke AF Valentine's Day Edition. This episode, I'm gonna teach you guys how to make a Valentine's Day dinner for two people with only five bucks. So I went to my local grocery outlet and found turkey Italian sausage for 250. I also grabbed a packet of spaghetti for only a buck and then two cans of tomato sauce for 70 cents each, which ends up being a grand total of $4.90 so if you guys want to see how I turn all of these ingredients into this, just keep watching. The very first thing I did was put on a huge pot of water and covered it with a lid and turned the heat on to high because the water needs to come to a boil so you can cook that spaghetti. Secondly, I turned on another stove, took a non-stick skillet and turned it on to medium high heat. Then I added my Italian turkey sausage. I did put a little bit of avocado oil on the bottom of the pan, but just use whatever oil you guys have. It doesn't even matter if it's olive or vegetable. As soon as I started browning off the turkey sausage, I started breaking it up into little pieces with my spatula because I wanted them to turn into crumbles. And the biggest, most important thing you can do for this dish here is to leave the sausage alone and let it brown. Because um, Anne Burrell said this, she said brown food is yummy food. When the turkey has texture and is golden, oof, it tastes so good. So I let it go for a little bit. And as you guys can see, a lot of the turkey actually started sticking to the bottom of the pan. That's totally fine because we're not gonna forget about it. After the turkey was cooked, which took about five to six minutes, I took it out of the pan and then added some water. Then I took a flat wooden spatula and started scraping the bottom of the pan to get off all those bits because those bits have a ton of flavor. Then I added my two cans of tomato sauce and stirred for a little bit. One really important thing to note is my tomato sauce already had salt added, so I didn't season it at all. In fact, tomato sauces are notorious for being super salty, so check your can. If it has, don't salt the sauce. If it's salt free, then season it to taste. Here comes a real special touch. They often say that the best things you get in life are for free, and in my case, it was McDonald's ketchup. We just had it lying around the house and it's a great trick to amp up any canned tomato sauce to stop it from being so acidic. Most canned tomatoes are super duper sour. So I added about three to four packets of ketchup and then I tasted it. And even after I tasted it, it was still a little too tart for my taste. So I added some sugar. If you guys don't have any sugar laying around the house, Go to Starbucks and pick up some sugar packets. While you're cooking your sauce, do not forget about your pasta. Take a bite, take it out of the water and cool it down and check it to see if it's ready. It should still have a little bit of a bite to it. If it does, then strain it and add it directly into the pasta sauce. I toss the sauce and the spaghetti together and the best touch ever. This is like a fancy trick that I actually learned when I worked at Cheesecake Factory. I took a ton of Costco Parmesan cheese packets, put it into a little plate. If you want to impress your significant other, do that. Take three to four packets, put it into a little saucer plate, and then serve it with a spoon and ask them how much they would like. <laughs> One of the most amazing things that you can do to amp up the feel of any meal is presentation, presentation, presentation. So how I presented my spaghetti was I took my fork into the pot and swirled it a little bit and I took three big coils of spaghetti and formed a heart, then topped it with the sausage, then on my fancy smancy Costco Parmesan cheese. I never said that this was like Nona's recipe or I never said this was authentic Italian. This is just good, cheap, easy, delicious food that you can make for someone that you love. What's super cool, what's super cool too is even after cooking this entire dish, you still have a ton of spaghetti left. You have a ton of turkey sausage left. All you need to do, if you wanna make more, all you need to do is buy more tomato sauce. If you guys learned something new, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. You'll be surprised how full your heart and your belly will feel when you're able to give someone something that no one else can which is food made by you. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Broke AF, Valentine's Day edition. And if you guys have any questions, feel free to leave them down below for me. Thanks so much for watching. Again, if you guys found value out of this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to see more videos of Broke AF. Next week, 
I'm gonna show you guys how to get rid of that really gross toilet ring in your toilet for under three bucks. I'll see you guys again next time.